Hi friends, I am Dr. B.V. Rao of Ushwa Clinic and founder of the website <coughs> qmedicaldoubts.blogspot.in and uh, rockbawmedicaldoubts.com. Through these videos, I am providing the basic knowledge about the commonly occurring diseases, treatment and surgery details when necessary for the medical knowledge to general people and for reference to medicals. Today, I am going to discuss about the volvulus diagnosis surgery. The volvulus of the stomach is the rotation of the stomach usually occurs around the axis uh, made by its uh, two fi fixed points, the cardia and pylorus. So, though the rotation can occur in a horizontal or vertical direction, it is common from the greater curvature with the colon moves upwards to lie under the cupola of the left diaphragm. The important predisposing ca cause, is, cause of this event is uh, eventration of the diaphragm from, the, from whatever so, uh, the cause. It is probable that the colon moves up first and uh, takes the stomach with it. It usually intermittent but uh, it may present in an acute form. Clinical features, fullness of the stomach. When the patient takes food, the, uh, he feels a fullness of the stomach. Epigastric pain. There is a slight epigastric pain and uh, retching. He has to wait for a moment to have another bit of food. Diagnosis. Diagnosis is established by barium meal. It is impossible to pass the stomach tube. Treatment. Operation is the only satisfactory treatment. The greater curvature of the stomach must be completely freed from the colon by division of the gastrocolic momentum. Must probably it uh, itself is uh, adequate for relief. A further safeguard, however, consists of fixing the greater curvature to the duodenogenal fracture of uh, fourth part of duodenum as in posterior gastroenterostomy without stoma. Where the rotation occurs as a result of and uh, into a large hiatal defect, the essential treatment consists of a closure of the hiatus around the esophagus. That's all about the volvulus. And in the next video, I will discuss about some other disease. Thank you.